Hi, I'm Kathy Anderson, and I am going to show you how I clean my brushes every single night without fail. Never ever leave painting for the day without cleaning my brushes. So these brushes, one at a time, I'll take the brush, get as much paint as possible off it the first time. And then this is my dirty turf that I've been using all day. This is a turf that I keep clean all day. I do have to say that Rosemary and Simi do suggest that you do not use Gamsol. They, they're very, very strict about thinking that Gamsol, and I'm sure that it's probably, I don't know if, if what the truth is on that because my some of my brushes here are pretty old and that's all I use is Gamsol. But I'm not hard on my brushes. I dip, wipe, dip, wipe until it's until my paper towel whoops is almost clean. That's not clean because my turf is pretty dirty. But once it gets to that point, then I go into my clean turf. And I don't, first of all, you should all, everybody should always throw those baskets away that come in your turf cans. Um, they, they do terrible damage to your brushes when you run like this. I don't go to the bottom and scrub around like that. I'm really careful. I dip and I'll wipe on a clean paper towel. And now you can see without much effort, that paper towel is clean. So how long does it take? And then I squeeze it. Try to get all the gamsol out, and I lay it flat, and you don't want to close up your brushes. In this class, I've been using a lot of brushes. Um, this amount of brushes will take me less than 10 minutes. And actually, that's a good tip all during the day, to don't, if you stick your brush in your gamsol filled with paint on it, then your gamsol is a, is a bucket of mud. And that's why I'm, I walk around to, to some of my students and I can't even clean my brush, their, or their brush, in their uh, turf because the turf is so dirty. So dip, clean turf, and that, look at that, it's completely clean, one brush at a time, and that's all.